Welcome to Cisco Training Videos. My name is Trevor. The topic for this video is the access list lookup phase on the Cisco ASA firewall. I'm going to go in depth into the phase and define exactly what it does in the packet inspection process. Let's begin. All right, first let's define exactly what an access list is. An access list is simply a list of permitted deny statements on a firewall that's either ingressing or egressing an interface on a firewall. Once an access list is applied to a firewall's interface, it becomes a vital part of that packet inspection process because that access list explicitly lists the type of traffic that can be permitted through. If it's not explicitly permitted, it's going to be implicitly denied. Access lists do not inspect a connection state. They simply define what packets are permitted or denied in a single direction. By default, access lists are not created or applied, though, to any firewall interfaces. Cisco ASA uses the default security policy of security levels in order to filter traffic. Alright, so as packets are processed through the previous stages and phases of the packet inspection process, as it makes its way towards the access list lookup phase, the first thing the firewall is going to do is see if an access list is even defined on an interface and make sure that it's applied to the direction that the traffic is coming from. If there is an access list defined, the traffic is going to be filtered using that list. A firewall can have multiple access lists, however, if an access list is not referenced and applied to an interface, it's not going to do anything. So keep that in mind when you're looking at your configuration. If there is not an access list configured on an interface, the firewall is going to resort to using its default security policy. This is where security levels come into play. Traffic sourcing from a higher security level, destined to a lower security level, is permitted. But traffic sourcing from a lower security level going to a higher security level is denied. The only situation when traffic going from a lower security level to a higher security level is permitted is when it's return traffic from a connection that was originated and initiated by a higher level security interface. So that's it. Access list lookup is extremely easy. Thank you for watching. Please leave any questions or comments in the comment section below.